It's Mascot Friday the 13th, yet another cursed edition of our regular look at platformer stars of the past. Welcome, it's almost the weekend, but first we gotta get through one last stream before we make, we make it official. Mm -hmm. Congrats everyone, it was a tough week, we made it through to the end. Wow. Uh, this weekend, f please feel free to celebrate. You know what, don't do it responsibly. I was gonna say celebrate responsibly, but you can celebrate irresponsibly this weekend, I've you all, decided. You all better be irresponsible assholes this weekend, or else <laughs> you're not doing right by us. But first of all, we got some business to take care of. Uh, this Wednesday we played Xbox Games, an original Xbox showcase. And you know what? Who represents the Xbox more than Blinks, the Time Sweeper? We'll also be looking at Blinks 2, Masters of Time and Space. So the two foremost mascot platformers for the Xbox, the exclusives, Blinks and Blinks 2 never ported anywhere else. Blinks 2, not backward compatible with any other Xbox. You gotta pull out the original system for that. So, shall shall we do this? Is this the only way people will see uh, that asshole? I don't know, everyone's an <laughs> asshole today. I'm just in a mood. <laughs> Put it on. Blink's the time sweeper for the original Xbox. But yeah, I've never played this game. Oh yeah, I here you go. To. Take it. So, so yeah. this is a show where we decide whether these games are better or worse than Gex 64. So please consider that while you view Blink's the time sweeper. Come on, Xbox. It's Microsoft Game Studios and Artoon, who did, oh. um, did they do Pinobi? I think we've covered one of their games before. I, I think so. Oh yeah, the new Xbox, uh, they announced that. Didn't oh yeah, they, they kind of crapped that out over the Game Awards. <laughs> Boy, what a big waste of time that was. <laughs> I didn't even watch. I'm they didn't even announce a Blink sequel. I thought he was due. He is due though, look at him. He's got the robot voice. I, I like this techno. Adjusting microphone slightly. Oh, thank you so much for Cambrinera for the resub. Cambrinera resubs 11 months in a row and says, Blinks the Teeth Sweeper. It's going to be one of those episodes, isn't it? Yep. He's going to turn into a dentist by the end. I'm pretty sure that's what he does now. Oh, there was a Donkey Kong sequence there. That's cute. I like all the impact on. Well, it was the time for it. <laughs> we were in the proto-meme era of 2003. Alex, I can has cheeseburger. Thank you to Vlad for resubscribing seven months. <laughs> I can has resub? Just for that joke, too. Man, it gets yeah, easier wow, every time. Yeah, wow, you did a really good job. Thank you. <laughs> All right, this looks fun and cute. I hope it is fun and so, also cute. So I realized just before the show, I was thinking, what kind of cat is this guy? He's a lynx, right? Because Blinx? Lynx? But he doesn't, Blinks? Have, he doesn't have the markings of a lynx. Lynx? Blinx? <laughs> is this your Uma, Oprah, Oprah, Uman? Uma? Yes. <laughs> Completing my transformation into David Letterman. I like, I like, I like that part of the logo says only on Xbox. Yep. It's, I'm sorry, it's baked into started. the it's baked into the logo. So this is an Xbox exclusive mascot. What can we expect from this? Well, he looks like a, that is not what a lynx looks like. So he has a magic vacuum, and he mm -hmm. can also control time. I think. I guess we should go ahead and watch. Well, whatever. Sorry. Jump right in. I just want to jump right. I don't want to be spoiled. We got two games to cover. Yeah. And we got to consider whether they are better or worse than each other. What are the options here? Okay. Is he a time cop? Is that who he is? Is he there with uh, Steven Seagal? That was Steven Seagal, right? Jean Claude Van Damme. That's Jean Claude Van Damme, I think. I probably already have some save data, but whatever. You can save over anything. <laughs> data boxes. Yeah. Okay, I kind of like this game's aesthetic so far. It looks like a fake computer. Mm-hmm. Made out of Duplos. 69 bits from Kate Lipsy who says, How many original Xboxes fit into the new Xbox tower? Oh, you can fit so many. It's like an Xbox suitcase. They turned it into a PCFX. I'm so happy. Yeah, it has a fake language, like Klonoa. What is that, like Esperanto? <laughs> No, Danny. 
It's not enough Oteros or Roast to be a fucking restaurant. Look at all the Blinkses! Wow, I love There's their... so many of them! Oh my god, these cats look cool. <gasps> this language sounds kind of Nordic. It's a bee, Blinks. <laughs> Oh, I didn't know there were so many of them. I'm sorry, they're so cute! They are cute. Oh, they're adorable! This guy had real mascot potential until he was stomped out by the hated Master Chief. Master Chief killed him himself? Yeah. What a bastard. That was the plot of Halo Reach. Oh man, he's so cute! He's his Yeah. <laughs> Tom Tom Gang. They had, a, they had a hit 80s single. Oh, there's real people in this world, too. Wait, wait, wait! So there's like. Oh my god, they're stealing our time and selling it for profit! Mm -hmm. This is. I'm sure some folks in chat have a lot to say about that. Wow. They turned people into Lucky Charms, they sure did. I'm Factory Clods. Uh-oh. Blinks! Whatever. Like what you like, Blinks. He's taken after his hero, Sonic. I love the Blinks race. I love these kitties! They're, they're so good. So just in terms of looks and aesthetics, Blinks is a winner. I don't know about the game, though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> they do sound Nordic. Boogaloo says it's the creator of Sonic Knights and Pinobi doing character design. Uh, what's that, Oshima? Yeah, yeah, I know. I think it was Oshima who started up Artoon, or, is it, or at least has a big role in it. Yeah, Oshima. Save the world, Blinks. You time cat. He's a Lynx. He is not a lynx, he does they do not have Okay, whatever. We will we will argue this later tonight <laughs> okay. and for tomorrow and ruin the weekend. Thanks to Hachiko Syndrome for the raid. Welcome everyone, this wow, is Blinks. Thank you. Blinks the Time Cat. And happy birthday, Ellie. I'm pretty sure it's it was recent. Maybe a happy belated birthday. Oh, yeah! Whoever's and what, birthday, it is birthday happy! And what better way to celebrate than an Xbox exclusive mascot? Oh, this seems a little complicated. So Blinks is unique. He has VCR controls. Sure does. Okay, so I can only do one of these. Kids today wouldn't be able to relate to this. How do I? How do I stop doing pause? Uh, I don't. Uh, okay, so I think that's a limited use power up. You can also vacuum things. Yeah, I found some trash! Hold the right trigger X. Got it. There's Blink's fan characters? Hang on. There's a Blink's fan character named Grover? <laughs> Where's Elmo? You can't do that. I can only have five pieces of trash at once. You've obviously never been to my house. I am excellent. And people think Grover is hot. Happy Friday, everyone. Can I can I see Grover? I'll show you Grover. <laughs> yes, I get to shoot trash! There he is. Wow, he is hot, and for all the furries out there, he kind of looks like a Jay Naylor uh, self-insert. He looks sad. Just that odd, but... 
Okay, so... Is Blinks a descendant of Bubsy? That could be the hidden backstory behind this. What do you think of the game? I love this tutorial stage. I know that seems kind of whatever, but I like the way it's guiding me. I like what it's doing. I like the aesthetic of it, like, circling things when it has something new to show me. I like that I throw trash at things. It seems pretty polished. This I has like... a lot of attention to detail paid to the uh, visual presentation. Yeah, I really... Oh, look at my shadow on the wall! Look! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm These sorry. These are, at least so far, very dense environments. Bad crystal combo. Yeah, you have to get the right crystals to get the power-ups. If you get the crystals in the wrong order, it, uh, it means nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay, come on here. Oh, look at him! Look at him go <laughs> stomp it! He's die! He's... People asking how the running feels. How does it feel to rumble around as blinks? Good! It feels normal. Like, I don't know what else to say. It feels very normal. He seems pretty slow, at least at first. Uh, yeah, I got a slow baby. Oh. So it has like a slot machine mechanic. Kind of. What you have to do is you have to get the crystals in the right order to make to. So it's like it is like a slot machine, but you get to choose the pieces if that makes sense. Okay. Like little, uh... Can you destroy all that stuff over there, like the benches? Uh, let me see. How much environmental destruction is in this game? Yeah, there you go. I pissed that guy off. Yeah, eat up his garden. Well... <laughs> Suck up everything. I just tossed his garden back at him. Blah! <laughs> I moved the bench! That rules! That's Thank good. You that's, me. that's good advice, JP Ronnie. Always blinks before you jinx. <laughs> just... And jinx is coming at some point. Oh, I see. Yeah, you pick up items to throw them, and ugh. So I guess he can't directly attack things. He's gotta have stuff stored in his vacuum. Mm -hmm. Can I, I want more bench? I, I need more... They call this trash, but this bench does not look like trash. Like, this is a nice bench. Thank you. This music, oh. is, this music is very Splatoon-ish, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Hey, good work with the time sweep. Thank you. I love this little guy looking he looks, up, oh my god. He looks so happy, too. Completely unlike the cover art. Oh, he smirked for a second. The, uh, the Japanese cover shows this Blinks. The happy, smiling Blinks. The US this, cover shows angry Blinks. Is this showing my play during the- It is showing my play during the level. Yeah, wow. it's a replay. Wow. Do his eyes glow in the dark like a real cat? That's creepy. I don't like when cats do that. Well, that's the best thing about cats. Yeah. It is really cool. It just creeps me out. I really like this game's kind of mishmash of aesthetics here in the in the user interface. I like uh, I like I like them circle. I still really like them just circling the objects that I need to pay attention to in like red ink. Like hey hey asshole. That's that's pretty important for games because we've seen several times where we've gotten lost because we're not paying attention. Sometimes games really need to hold your hand. Look at that kitty power up! I need it. Oh, you need gotta it. get that. It's got a big eye. You've got a... What is that arrow on the right? Slow. Is that slow? Okay. Yeah. I have a slow... Oh, I need to get more trash. Hold on. Trash! <laughs> Blinks. Blinks the trash collector. Yes! Blinks and I have something very much in common. We look at trash and we're like, this should be in a museum. How many games have we played where you collect trash? <laughs> It's like one of the most common things in games, aside from like sewer levels. At least Woody Woodpecker isn't making you do it or whatever. Yeah, Abby is linking to the Japanese and US Blinks boxes. Pretty, pretty big difference. Yeah, honestly, the Japanese box makes me want to play the game more. The US one looks kind of generic. But that's the template they're going for. I just want to say I like that the uh, money icons here look like the bit icons. Thank they're you. very shiny, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks like, to Blinks for the five bits. Blinks says... Stop! Blinks with... says, Gex ain't shit. Honestly, that is what he would say. Use a slow. Okay, okay. Uh, Seems like a good time for it. Eh? Uh... Hey, ow! It was not a good time for it. Rewind it. Run it back. That's neat. <laughs> I 
I love his cartoonish eyes. His eyes are really expressive. That's strange for this Look kind of game. Him! That's a good pose. So it looks like you had a life meter in the upper left, and those are your amount of retries, I suppose. Enemies got their own life meters, a la later Sonics. God, he's so cute! He's a cute cat. He collects garbage. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He kills monsters. So, he's like me. What's not to like? He's no voodoo Vince. That's the one we gotta get around to. That's another Xbox exclusive platformer. Hey, they remade him. This seems like it had a lot of resources poured into it, which is kind of a shame that it's so under-discussed. You never hear Blinks talked about among the, uh, the great mascots. And maybe there's a reason for that, but at least so far, this seems okay? I like it. Except camera, camera, camera. Okay. Whoa! Pink boy. Pink boy's here. Oh, that's your last life. Damn. Sorry, Blinks. You're Re dead. Really? Game over? Jesus. Yep, just three hits. I guess you don't have lives. That's pretty interesting. In this again. Yeah, we got Toby in this again. Man, only Blinks was brave enough to get rid of the live system. That's what's missing from modern mascots. Bravery. Bunch of chicken shits. <laughs> okay, okay. First of all, what modern mascots even exist other than, like, <laughs> fucking Mario and, and Sonic? Like, they I'll, don't, is the thing. That's the thing. They're all dead. You're, you're like, you know, you're, you're, you're besmirching the dead. Blinks like, was in Digital Foundry's Good Water video? Oh, I gotta see the water in this. I bet this game does have good water. So these missions seem like kind of seek and destroy sort of things. Less than just getting to the goal. I'm fascinated by this Blinks. I, 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 like, I love observing him in his natural habitat. Oh man, what hit me? Oh that guy. That guy did. Use a use a slow or a pause when you deal with enemies. Okay, but it's it's hard to bring up is the thing. I tapped him on the side, I think. Yep. He's deadly to the touch. The Xbox was more powerful than PS2, yeah. I think in terms of hardware horsepower it was like Xbox, then GameCube, then PS2. You gotta hold the button. I am. And then you hit, uh... I see. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, smash him. I don't need trash. Pick up that trash. You stopped time so you could pick up trash. <laughs> okay, but how many times have you known me, like, if I'm in a thrift store, you know I will stop time to pick up trash. Yeah, true. If I see trash, I need it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure GameCube was more powerful than PS2, though, correct me if I'm wrong. It, they may just be incredibly similar. Oh, this guy you gotta pause on. Or maybe not. Maybe you got your own plan. No, I should have paused. <laughs> no, -uh, I'm not gonna listen to what Danny says. <laughs> this is like... I'm a time sweeper. <laughs> listen! I just, I see the cute cat and all game strategies out the window. Yeah, it was, it was disk sport storage space that was the main issue for the GameCube. Because those disks could only be one gig. PlayStation 2 had dual density DVDs, on the other hand. Can't play God of War on your GameCube. Okay, I need a crack up. Okay. I'm bringing up the old console war from three generations ago. <laughs> Does anyone even still remember? I didn't mean to do that, but... Are any of the participants from three generations ago's console war still alive? We should interview them. I mean, are we part of that war? I mean, I avoided that draft. I don't know about you. I you got it. You worked at GameStop at that time. You were... <laughs> you were like an enemy commander. <laughs> oh, I were... Listen, it was only for a short while. Oh, that's not... We honor them on Memorial Day. Yeah, that's what that's for. Yeah. 
That is true. SNES versus Genesis is still a pretty hot topic. Less so for Xbox versus GameCube. I think most people just don't care. Yeah, there you go. That's using the old noggin. See, I can relate to Blanks. If I had the power to stop time, I would totally do it and throw garbage at my enemies. <laughs> that tracks. I don't stop time and they'd be like, "Arg! I feel like I just got hit by a garbage can. You could slow him. I, oh yeah, I could. Let's do that. <laughs> PlayStation versus Saturn versus N64. There's still some N64 diehards. Hmm. You need garbage, my friend. There's garbage. It's 64 diehards have three hands, yeah. Look, it's called Got Gamer it. Evolution. Gamers will evolve to suit the controller they need. Nice work. Okay, it looks like you only got one more enemy to tag. Got it. Stock up on garbage. Can do! You've seen, you've seen what I, when I purchase from thrift stores. I, I get the best garbage. Man, I haven't gotten garbage in a while. What a shiny door. Everything is shiny. Wow, look at that. Just a bunch of fallen things. No thank you. <gasps> a secret cat medal! Yes! I love cool stuff! God. Alright, you're all loaded. I'm Just loaded go in there and, there and kill whatever's in there. Okay. Yes, I got another pause. Alright, up the hill. Now we're relitigating re the N64 debate. Wow! Real mature! I guess the debate is, does it have good wrestling games? And the answer is yes. <laughs> they should teach you to use your time powers more in time school. Well, I'm just gonna stomp on this. And it's... I'm too busy thinking about trash. I'm sorry, Danny. Yeah, the original Xbox did have a lot of poker games. World Series of Poker, uh, Poker Men, the sequel Poker Ladies. Wait. I know you're lying, but... Some of those aren't real. That way, not that way. I'm missing. Okay. What's that bumble ball there? That was, the <laughs> that was where the guy was that I killed. Oh, I see. Well, keep looking. You'll find it. You may need to go back down. Wow. Oh, I see. I opened this. Poker 2? At the time they made a sequel. Oh, so they made a sequel to Poker? <laughs> the Leisure Suit Larry game for original Xbox does not have jumping, but unfortunately Box Office Bust does. And that game <laughs> is way worse in every way. Just jump in there. I, I want trash. Can you take it with you? No, but I want it anyway. <laughs> You got what you wanted. All right, I, I think it's almost. I think it's your turn. Okay. I've been playing Thank for. You. I played two stages. What do you think so far? I really like it. He seems all right, this guy. Yeah, he's a teethy boy. I'm ready to believe in our toothy friend Blinks. I like him. My voice is cracking. I like him. He's a good boy. He is. It's. Uh, it's my, I sound like a. I, I'm just too ex excited. All right, time for the Blinks expert to take over. All right, Danny. They should have called the new Xbox the Xbox Blinks, because it has an X in it. Well, that's because they're not cool enough to bring Blinks back. You know that even though we live in... Oh, look at oh this nurse Oh my god! Cat. Pardon me, she, she is an angel. She's adorable, yeah. She's angel. Look, they're the cowards, cowards, cowards. You can buy 
new hoodies? I love this hoodie cat so much. I probably need another retry. I like her so much. <laughs> oh, yeah. I love this guy on World Championship Poker 2 featuring they Power sent me, Legendary. I'm pretty sure that's the game they sent me review code for. Guess oh, what? It's we, poker. I think we played that, right? I remember playing one of those with y'all. It was really bad. Alright, there's an in-game shop. You can do upgrades. You can get better vacuums, better hoodies, and more life points for when Alex uses them all up. So what's the gameplay here? You just suck and blow, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, um, let's see. Electric Boogaloo, Funk mentioning the sound was mainly handled by Mariko and Nan Namba and Keiichi uh, Sugiyama of uh, Sega's Wave Master, who had worked on uh, Sonic Heroes and the Super Monkey Ball game. Oh, but... Keiichi Sugiyama, not Koichi Sugiyama. <laughs> Be like, wow, that's a prestigious name for this game. <laughs> well, you're being banned. Um, from Chad Danny, by the way. Okay, that's fine. So what do you think? I kind of like this. He's kind of slow, he's very deliberate. Mm -hmm. And the gameplay is kind of unlike what we've seen in other mascot platformers, because it's really a, a seek and destroy kind of thing. How do you launch? Oh, I see. Uh, I'm being, uh, Uzi is, is, is linking to the worst Xbox game listing on Amazon, and if you don't mind, I'm going to click it. Is this on there? I'm gonna get mad if it is. This game's fine. <laughs> wow, that's a great picture of World Series of Poker 2. <laughs> Chad, if you didn't click on that, please click on that. That's a really good listing. Um... What's interesting is the sucking is the same button as the blowing, so you just hold it to suck in and you tap to let go. So very, very simplified. So in the game they call it throwing, not not blowing and sucking, Danny. Uh, look, I'm just trying to simplify here so everyone knows what we're talking about. Not so sure if I like the uh, item collecting mechanics. That seems kind of unnecessary. Yeah. Having I to collect multiple to get just one thing. Yeah, I don't like that either. Uh, what's the time button? Uh, it is the red one. Yeah. Time stop. Enjoy the garbage. Okay, so Abby is linking to uh, Japan exclusive Xbox games, and it's all fucking. There's some strange ones. There was a few posted to our Discord earlier. Yeah, yeah. There was like... uh, Cat, which is a game about cat girls, and it's called Cybernetic Attack Team. The cat stands for something. Ah, so they're like they're like uh, weaponized cat girls. Yeah. Wow. What? <laughs> Do you think one day they're gonna like? draft cat girls into like a war. Or that, that would be terrible. I mean sorry, sorry, I, I shouldn't think about cat girls in here. Alex. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hmm. Yeah, these lucky charms. See, in these kind of games I just want to scoop everything up. That's what you do, you get the collectibles. And when you're punished, I don't like that. Yeah, yeah, because I just want to collect everything without thinking, but this game is like, you gotta think before you take things, and I'm just like... Well, actually, you're not punished, it's just... you don't get anything. But you kind of need this stuff, you know? What if... okay, the, if this game is just called Nude? There's a game just called Nude, Danny. Yeah, it's kind of like... I saw that in Discord. It's kind of like Seaman, but with, uh, an anime <laughs> girl. <laughs> Look at his eyes! His eyes are great. Run it back. Alright, what is Cat? Cat doesn't look that bad. I... Pardon me, but I've seen hornier, thank you. Yeah, it looks it looks fine. Right. Anyone out there play Cyber Attack Team Cat? <laughs> Probably not. No, the way he does the wall thing! Does, does he scramble up the wall? Listen to him. Hear that? He goes, meow. You gotta hold the button for that to work. I don't think it works. I just like the noise he makes. Oh, he just clings onto the wall. He makes that's the noise buttons makes when he uh, wants something in the morning. That's oh. accuracy. That's attention to detail right there. Mm -hmm. This is 
so cute. Oh my god. You know, I don't like a lot of the, the 3D mascot platformers of this era. I find a lot of them to be kind of charmless, but I really like this. Yeah, that's when the whole edginess trend started, and that's when mascots got a lot less interesting. Blinks seems to be immune from that, though. Though, judging from the cover of the sequel, I think he got a little edgy. We'll find that out in a bit, though. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't like that there's, like, good and bad combos. There should be no bad combos. Thank you! All combos are good combos. Just let me have my extra life points. I don't like falling off the roofs either. As long as we're naming things we don't like about this game. Okay. Um. I think that's 16 tons It's a very cartoonish world. Apparently, Blinks is 70 bucks on Amazon if you want one. Which Blinks? I don't know. Uh, I think the original for Xbox. This game was $5. <laughs> I got it because it had a Microsoft employee sticker on it. I thought that was cool. <laughs> it was all like, do not sell ever. Your employment will be terminated. Alright, uh, Blab wondering if, uh, 20, if in 2020 Blink should be the new Gex. Hell, yeah, why not? Alright, Gex, you're done. You are fucking done for. We haven't heard anything from Gex in a while. Oh, the exit was over here the whole time. Gex, you're a goner. You're just done for. Alright, so these levels are more Banjo-Kazooie-ish in that they're open-ended and you have to hunt for things. But they're not, like, collect-a-thon themed. It's very specific. It's hunt and destroy. I'm just trying to, to, to put my finger on this Blinks to figure out what makes him tick what this game's all about. I think I almost get it. Let's, we, play, let's play a couple more levels, Are we though. really shipping Blinks and Gex? Do you really think that would be a relationship that would work? Blex. Some, yeah, Ravenworks already is talking about Blex. I, I, no, no, I mean... I mean, you, you, no, that's not fair. You, you, I, I, I also, you do you. You, you, you <laughs> love who you love. You... Love is love, right? That's what they say? Even That's... for Gex and yeah. Blinks. Dude, what? I'm sorry, Grover is too hot for Blinks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I know that you're talking about a different Grover. Grover is... Or are you? <laughs> <laughs> Let's fight the first boss. <laughs> Who is shipping Blinks and Glover? Get out! Oh no, it's the number wizard. He looks like a Muppet. Kinda. Again, Blinks and Grover! Oh, man. This controller rumbles. <laughs> Revenant, I'm pretty sure Grover House and Grover the sexy original Catboy Blinks character are different. No, Grover built that house. <laughs> hey, you think that's the sexy Catboy's handiwork? I think so. <laughs> He's good at looking sexy and not much else. <laughs> I'm just sorry, I'm just thinking about a bunch of sexy cat boys building the worst house on Earth! Do I have a dodge move or anything? No, it's really hard. <laughs> cat boys working on a construction site. <laughs> they are so terrible at it! All they know is how to be hot! They have no clue what to do. I collect all four, is that a special combo? No. No, it's a bad crystal combo. Yeah, you have to get the right crystals. Got him once. Alright, people are doing many other ships, including shipping Glover with uh, Kathy. If we're gonna ship Glover with anyone, it should be someone who needs gloves. Not, a, not another piece of clothing. That just well, makes no sense. It makes total sense. If they like get a shirt together and a pair of pants, their polycule will be set. A whole damn outfit. 
<laughs> we are having like three different discussions at once. So sad. He just looks so happy when he's sucking up that garbage. He does! He's a, I, I feel it! I feel it! He's happy in his work. Alright, we're, uh, let's see, Remnant's Green Polycule is Glover and Master Hand in Hamburger Hell Park. Whoa! That's a power move! That's All pretty right. racy. I don't know if I can approve that. <sighs> pretty hard did some cool coyote who says, Blinks 3, enter the gay rodeo, coming to the <laughs> Xbox sex. It's Friday, baby! It's Friday! Happy Friday, everyone. Alright, I beat the first boss. That was pretty straightforward. Really, the biggest issue with Blinks is he just kind of lumbers, he doesn't have any dodge moves. I guess that's what his powers are for, but... Uh, what if you hadn't been collecting the powers or playing the game right? Did they consider that? <laughs> what if the person playing the game is a complete idiot? It's... it's... I mean, see, this is... see what I mean when I was, like, having issues and stuff? It, like, it can be kind of hard to control sometimes. Like, it's just, just in the sense that things will go for, to, right towards you and you have no time to react. Yeah. I think he could use a dodge roll, mm -hmm. personally. Like a tactical roll. Well, let's see. Before we go, I just want to say Blinks uh, Desros is uh, giving us Blinks X Knack, so... Nice. Feel, feel how you will about that. Two forgotten, uh, badly treated mascots, if I'm being frank. Then again, Knack got a sequel too, so whatever. You know, it's fine. He had his chance. Me and Alex played all the way through the original Knack. We need to do Knack 2 sometime. Maybe we should do that on stream. I think so. I think Knack 2 would be more entertaining than the first one. Mm -hmm. Alright, round two Deja Vu Canals. Wonder what kind of garbage they got here. Oh man, I bet it's real nice. So you gotta look at this game differently. You gotta actually look at the background detail details and figure out what you can put into your vacuum. What you can suck? Yeah, it's your ammo. Think more like Master Chief. This is the Xbox. I kinda like the Seek and Destroy formula. It keeps it pretty simple even when the level layouts aren't so simple. I love his little... Oh, he's so cute. He's adorable. Alright, now let's find more stars and moons and rainbows. What was it like? Hearts, stars, horseshoes, clovers, and blue moons. Pots, Pots of golds and rainbows, and me red balloons. <laughs> oh, no. My life has been wasted. <laughs> My entire brain space is devoted to old commercials. Listen, listen. Maybe this will be like the uh, uh, the giver situation. You have to pass this knowledge on from generation to generation. <laughs> Back in my day, a leprechaun would steal our cereal. Him or that damn rabbit. Like, and he's like, "Wow, I can see why we got rid of commercials. They fucking suck." Okay, so you do have to be mindful when collecting items. That's a definite contrast compared to other platformers. Especially in this era. This is post-rare on N64, where you would just gobble up everything all over the level. Yeah! And everything had eyes, and it was really creepy. I have to really fight that instinct, and it sucks. I also don't like that you collect hearts, but the hearts aren't like extra life hearts over there. So. Yeah, you need to collect multiple hearts before that you get rewarded one. I think hits should be easier to come by, instead of having to buy them and they don't regenerate between levels. I don't like that. At least earlier on, they should have make it, made it easier. This is good looking water. Look at this. Wow, that water looks amazing. Holy moly, all right. That's some nice water you got there, Blinks. Damn, man. Oh, I want to squeeze him. Oh, <laughs> I want to pet him and he's going to be like, Rrr. He's probably pretty fierce. Did he just eat my garbage? Yeah. Yeah, throw a bomb at him. Uh. I didn't know what that's what that was. Gotta carefully avoid some of the 
some of the power-ups. Why doesn't that go far? That just drops where you set it. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, it worked. I am, I am not... Okay, fine. I am the murderous child of Myra from Looney Tunes. <laughs> Finally, the truth comes out. I am... All children, not all children. All animals are dead in my presence, I guess. Oh man. Well, I guess there's a power I can use to heal that bridge, huh? Mm -hmm. Power of love. I'm <laughs> throwing trash and all the time crystals go it everywhere. It displaces the power-ups? That's kind of weird. Oh, uh, whatever. Can I still make the jump? No, he cannot. He can double jump. Just like all cats can. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I'm out of garbage! No, no, where's your garbage? Gotta go down in the dump again. Yeah. Okay, you got the extra heart. That feels good. Okay, so I guess if you do collect enough hearts, you do get a extra thing. Okay. Yeah, but it's part of that uh, ridiculous thing where you have to collect multiples. Unfortunately, I don't think that Danny could suck those balls earlier. <laughs> what? That is unfortunate. It is very unfortunate. Happy Friday, everyone. <laughs> You made it to Friday so we can make the, the world's most obvious ball jokes. Thank you. What's our time looking like? Well, it is now 8.43, so... Okay, we can spend a little bit more time with this, I think. Mm -hmm. hey, oh, everyone. oh, oh, I see. Let's, let's go ahead and do that. What do you say we... turn back time to where this was a platform again? That's pretty clever. Yeah, that's something. You're right, I do need to hear a crappy Bill Murray impersonator saying, I wonder what happens when I suck this every single <laughs> second. Which is the better vacuum game, Blinks or Garfield for the PS2 in PAL regions? Oh, there's the last guy. Did, did Bioshock Infinite have you collecting trash and then throwing trash? Because... Those games always had you digging through trash. I like that. That was the game where you'd always just, like, rifle through the trash cans and eat a bunch of potato chips. Ooh. I like that, too. They had Beach Boys music, too. You would like that game. They had Beach... They... Did they? Yeah. I thought Bioshock... What? Bioshock Infinite had a, a cover of a Beach Boys song. Except it was different because we're in a different reality or something. Anyway, That's... Blinks invented Bioshock is what I'm trying to say. Oh man, Blinks. So from what I've got from this game is it's a little bit slow paced, but that's not a bad thing. These levels are small but detailed. They're packed with stuff for you to find, garbage to suck up, and just a few amount of enemies you gotta defeat. It's a little bit different from the other platformers we played. He's a more down-to-earth kind of guy, a denser mascot. He's not just one of those yahoos who runs around and jumps off walls. <laughs> wow, Danny has grievances. <laughs> and I guess if you learn how to deal with the power-up system, you can eventually get more gold, get more power-ups. Oh, I'm sorry. She's like, all right, see ya. Uh, she guilt trips you if you don't buy anything. She's like, thanks for wasting my time. Let's do this one more level. And then I think we got a nice, firm grasp on Blinks. He's alright! My, all... my overall opinions are trending positive. Alright. Keep the time, monsters. Okay. Man, what would they do in the sequel? What would that even be like? I guess we're probably gonna find out. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! He destroyed you! Sure did! Alright, I like the rewind mechanic for that, because it means you don't have to accept being knocked into a river. <laughs> That's fine by me. I don't like that guy, by the way. Shit. I don't like him. 
Hang on. Hang on. Stuck in a pattern. Shit. See, see, earlier you're giving me shit about this guy, but he's hard, right? He he's is. Difficult. He's yeah. He's kind of a pain. Got him. There you go. Take, Take that. that guy. Yeah. Oh man, look at that TV! Oh, I got all non-Euclidean twisted there. Yoink. The, that pig! He just disappeared. Alright, time to rewind. Well, this is the game's claim to fame. They did claim this is the first 4D action game. Okay, 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 okay. Question to the audience. How come... In 2001 to, like, 2006, everything was claiming it was 4D. Well, everything wanted to be better than 3D, you see. I... okay, I guess. All I remember is that there were, like, fucking 4D rides. There were 4D roller coasters, whatever the hell that means. It's just... Where's the extra dimension? Yeah, what is it? Is it time? I'm sorry, when I'm spinning upside down, that's not a time thing. That's just spinning <laughs> that's upside That's just me being down. sick. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh, there was 4D boxing on your Mac in middle school? Well, then what, what is with this? I know 4D boxing. That was like a polygonal game, I think. I don't know why the term 4D pisses me off like a fucking Linux nerd or yeah, whatever. Yeah, you're losing it. I am, I am. You're going feral over here. I am. I'm feral mode here. Oh yeah, and they have... <laughs> yeah, the extra dimension in 4D movies is getting water sprayed in your face. <laughs> Or smells. Crumbling? I know, I know you're not telling the truth, because there's no way that could be possible, but I really do wish Blinks was in Q2 Hyper Q. If only. Quit eating my garbage! I worked for that! What do you gotta do with this guy? I think you gotta throw that bomb at him, but again, I oh, don't. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, okay, Danny, we're, we're down the nostalgia hole here. So, right. Jesus. So, do you remember in the 90s when um, all those sitcoms were doing shit like, oh, we're in 3D, or oh, it's got smell of vision and you'd go down to, like, fucking Burger King and pick shit up? <laughs> they would have Burger King tie-ins? No, yeah, yeah. You'd go I just to, remember like, the trend of uh, live episodes and remember them all being bad. Yeah, they were terrible. Yeah, but no, there was a whole thing where it was like, oh, this has got a smell of vision and it's Ellen DeGeneres, but if you if you scratch this now, it smells like shit or whatever. Now she's smelling DeGeneres. <laughs> oh god, yeah, the uh, the Drew Carey 3D episode. Yeah, yeah. Drew Carey was the one I was thinking of having a bad live episode. <laughs> Why am I thinking about the Drew Carey show? Why not? Welcome back to the 2000s, everyone. Yeah. Oh no, I got death! Jesus. It's a tough world out here for a time cat. Okay, with Third Rock that had the uh, tie-in with Burger King, thank you, Trap of Luxury, I no longer... I feel like I'm going less insane. I appreciate it. You've made Alex's day. I guess if you wanted to criticize this, you could call it plotting, which it is a little bit... But it's more exploration focused, and yet not aimless, which I appreciate. I just saw the word Squidward embryo. Maybe I should move on. <laughs> That's disturbing. It's awful. Every decade was a mistake, Ragu. Yeah. I mean. Basically. What's wrong about this decade, though? Well, it's almost over. That's the only good thing about it. Oh man, it's gonna rip ass. When it's done. 2020, the year of the Retro Pals. Got him. Yeah, why did... Yeah, I'll just... God, whatever, whatever. I'm, I'm thinking too much about 90s sitcom uh, gimmicks. That's, that's no good for anyone. <laughs> Alright. Alright, that's Blink's Time Sweeper. Honestly, considering how little press this game gets, I was expecting this to be horrible. I thought it would be the worst video game, and yet... It's alright. I like Blinks. He's a little bit overproduced, if anything. This definitely looks like an Xbox game. 
Maybe that's what turned people off. Like, usually platformers are known for their simplicity, not their, uh, excellent graphics. But Blinks asks, why not both? Why not have a great platformer and a graphical showcase? You can't do that. Just did. Damn. Blinks, the time sweeper. Next up, here's the game I'm interested in. Blinks 2, Masters of Time and Space. So, I just, I, what are your, I have one weird impression going into this game. Yeah. I, I saw the, the American box art, and I gotta say. They added a leather daddy on the box art for the U.S. version. Thank you for just saying it. He's, I, he's not present in the Japanese one. They leather daddied him up. You can look at the two and compare them. Okay, so I've actually ridden Shrek 4D. I actually uh, went on it when it was doing a, a test run, uh, like a soft, o not soft opening, but like they were testing it in uh, Universal Studios Hollywood. And uh, I just want to say that was, they make some real fucking raunchy jokes in the pre-show about. <laughs> here we go. Here's the video game. Yeah, let's move on. Something good. No, no raunchy Shrek here. That's -uh. for our next Shrek stream. Nothing about uh, Pinocchio's box. underwear choices here. Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Oh, Pinocchio. Yeah, the 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 pre-show has a whole skit about Pinocchio's underwear. That's good. Our tune is back for the sequel. Come pet the cat. Now you saw, <laughs> you saw the first game how there was a mi million blinkses. Did you want to make your own blinks? Yes, 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 yes. This yes. game. Absolutely lets it absolutely lets you do that. Mm, 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 mm. He has a hyper cloak. He has a black hole. He has a warp tunnel. What more do you want? I am so excited. I get to make my own blink sona. Oh, I love them all. This is so good. This is why you ended up with Grover the Blinks because of this game. Yeah, that would make sense that someone would play this and they'd be like, wow, I need to make my cat, my character really hot. And Versus mode. I don't even know what that is. Okay. What are my options? Oh, I love this. Uh-huh. Hey! Hey, there you go. Oh, it starts on easy. Thank you, folks. I That's nice of them. That. Yeah. There's parts where he plays the pigs, too. Do they have different mechanics? Are they, are they good looking? Alex. Sorry. Alex just asking the questions everyone's thinking. You sure oh. there's treasure in this place? <laughs> Hold your tongues and keep moving. They learned English! That sucks. I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> I like their made up language. Pig boy's boss, back. Boss. Let's get out of here. I got a bad feeling. I'm afraid this our gang could be a bunch of scaredy cats. Magnificent! What is it here? We better be careful. We've never stolen anything like this before. Wow, that's a big time crystal. Ooh, yeah. It's gotta be worth 20 million, right? <laughs> tunnel pigs rule. I like We're the tunnel guys. pigs. I do like these tunnel pigs. Me. Look at his shitty beard. I love it. It's like the Oh, whole... he does have that shitty nerd beard. He's got a Linux beard. He does. <laughs> I'm sorry. So this game had a co-director. It was not Oshima's work alone. So they beefed it up, added another director. Wow, he's so handsome! And you're almost ready to take the Time Sweeper graduation exam. Okay, I think you want Custom Select here. You know I want Custom Select. Look at this furry wow, squad you, you got, can make. You got a tall one, and a shorter one, and and, and, a, and that one, and... I like that it gives you a shuffle option. Push that, see what it does. Uh, yes, does it just, sir. Oh man, it does all four. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, they're all angels. I love them all. And um, you can go in and customize individual ones, so once you get a good shuffle, I think you can fine-tune from there. Okay, I want... That's neat. I'm glad they have the the uh, wide cat faces in addition to the round ones. There are those are actual cat faces. Oh, I love all these kitties. I want to be look at look at look at the 
this chest heavy one? Like they're so buff. Okay, I need to find. All right, everyone's All right. everyone's a fan of this mode. It looks like. Yep, you get to make yeah, your yeah. your own damn. Wow! Dance. Wow! Look at this. Look at the Sonic at... Forces shit. What's this? That's amazing. Okay, I want to make a really cool one. So give me a sec here. Uh, I think just plain will be fine. Well, actually, that. Can you write words on them, like the Rock Band character created? <laughs> oh my God! If I can. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna be wearing Retro Pal style merch here, so yeah, that looks good. This actually is really neat. I just thought it would be an afterthought, but man, each piece of clothing is customizable. Okay, I'm wearing some nice uh, gray jeans here. Very shiny. Give each of them a letter so it spells out time. Oh, look at my chucks. <laughs> my chucks are cool now. Oh, you got chucks. Uh, my goggles should be also purple. Are goggles mandatory? I think they yes. are. Yes, gloves, my gloves. I like my gloves. Oh, wow. Um, I think they should also be purple. Uh, my metal should be... Is that purple? Okay. Can you Body must... tie! Hell yeah! Oh my god, look at all the furs I can... Well, I was, I was about to say that it's probably not possible to Monster Factory this, but they're giving you actually actual sliders here. <laughs> and again, these just pick different presets, so... But still. Foot size? How can you tell? All the way to 100, baby. Alright. <laughs> just like Dead or Alive. The biggest calves. The biggest feet. The biggest thighs. <laughs> oh, welcome to Friday. I don't need to be, I don't need to be that tall. You want tall. to be big and tall or short and stubby? I'm, I actually want to be stubby. Tail tip size. Tail tip size! Bigger! 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 Big bushy tail! Yes! My god, what have I done? Yes! What have I done? You can give the cats a massive Oh my chest. god, that's too big! <laughs> Look at that, it's, it's bigger than his... Okay, I gotta make his arms bigger at least. Oh, he looks... Okay, his shoulders need to be way bigger. Yeah, this is quickly turning into a chungus. <laughs> neck band. Oh, I thought that said neck beard. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Tiny ear! Oh, baby, stubby ear! You can make the head really big. <laughs> He's wider shoulders. Shorter! Shorter! Oh, oh no. Oh, you've made a character design for a different game. He doesn't even mesh with the other cats now. <laughs> no, he's good. He's good, Danny. All right, there's Does he there's have purple eyes? there's your leader, the the leader of the bunch. You know him well. <laughs> he is he is okay. stumpy and he is ready for battle. Oh, <laughs> look at him. He's perfect. He's the hero we need. All right, choose him. Uh, Finish. I don't think you need to adjust the other guys. Uh, you can't give him a name! You can oh, name him! Oh boy! Folks, oh. what's this kitty's name? Guys, y'all, y'all, folks. Everyone's a big fan I'm of the Chunky trying. Kitty. <laughs> I couldn't... That's a really in-depth character creator. You let him squash and stretch Let's and... see, I see Smoosh. Crisp. I like Crispy. I like Crispy. Chonk. Dana, Chonkers, peanut, Pants, like Peanut, peanut Grover, Pants Grover, Grover. <laughs> this is Grover! This is our sexy cat man! Alright, this is Alex's take this on Grover. On Grover. <laughs> this is my sexy cat boy! He's so handsome. Do not steal. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love you, Grover. Oh, I get an emblem? Oh, this rules. Oh, I don't like that one. Um, I like that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yin Yang, classic. I like this ska looking one. It's like I'm in the ska troops. <laughs> Do it. You like me different colors. Good lord. Oh, that one is so. There is customization on Ugh. customization. Listen, okay. No one's gonna miss that flag. Look at my beautiful flag. Oh my god, look at my new pride flag. It's so. It's a pride flag for. for. for stubby cat boys. Yeah. Oh my god, it's, my new, it's a new trans pride flag, everybody. We're, we're never going to get out of here. It's, this is the, the entire game. My team name? Um, oh, there is so much you can do. Uh, I think my team name should be... Um, um, Why Pride? I like that. That's the name now. <laughs> what? 
You don't like that? Is that offensive to you, Danny? A little bit. Okay, okay, okay. How about just, uh... How about Wide Load? That's the name of the team? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there you go. This cat is going to be completely useless in battle. Yeah! He's going to be able to jump like two inches. All right, confirm it. <laughs> look at our team! Wow, they're all they're all coordinated. You got Morris, you got Blanco, and you got <laughs> Joshua. Look at that really tall head. What a cool team! <laughs> I don't great. even care what the game's like. This is better than Gex. Oh, I get a badge. Oh, I didn't a game. <clears throat> pardon me, but why didn't a game aesthetics go this way? I don't know. Oh, you can save over that. That was my test save. Okay. And they give you a lot of suggestions for names and combinations, too. That was the one I got, Light Feet. I like Wide Load better, though. Mm hmm Wow. All right. Time to head into battle with your team. Okay. Look at the balloons. Can you see the balloons? There's one. Two and there's three. Oh, I have to... Yeah, you gotta really look at them. Oh, you're so stumpy. I'm fine, dude. Your head looks like clay that's been squished. <laughs> I look... And he's making good. little kissy mouse, mouth faces. <laughs> Basically, you're the best mascot now. Sorry to all other mascots. Mm, there's first person, huh? I don't like that, but what can you do? Not put it in the game. Listen, you can't just not put a feature in a game. Move the left thumbstick. Alright. Oh, you still got the glowy eyes from the first game. That's good. Alright! This game came out within a week of Halo 2! Oh, poor Blinks! Poor Blinks. You didn't deserve that. Oh my god, I am a rescue cat. Oh, I finally lived my dream. You found your game. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Master Chief really did kill him. Okay, so this is, uh, taking some inspiration from the popular Prince of Persia's yeah. Sands of Time, I guess. Boy, okay. how pissed do you think Blinks was when Prince of Persia did the whole time mechanic and they got all the, uh, the plaudits and Blinks was ignored? No! Did you hear my voice? I was yeah. like... It's like one of the bears from Camp California. Halo with a cat protagonist. That's how it should have been. Why didn't Halo have a cat in it? Bastard. There we go. Sorry, he's good. Yay! You've done it. This seems more straightforward and tutorial like than the mm -hmm. one in the first game. Okay. Then again, maybe the first game needed a little bit more teaching. But eh. this kind of goes a little bit overboard. Oh, I have different controls for uh, time sweeping now. Mm. You don't use X uh, to sweep, you use the trigger. Okay. Oh, there's a lock on now. Yeah, and then use the right thumbstick. No, not click it. <laughs> they just mean like push left or right. Oh, I see. Okay. Fire trash. Oops. I know what I'm doing. I know how to play a video game. Oh, if I wait more trash will appear? Yeah, the movement does look pretty good, especially considering what Alex does to that poor cat. <laughs> look at my arms! Man, he's, he's a stomping cat. Alright, being able to lock on is helpful. That may have been in the <laughs> first game, but if it was, we didn't figure it out. I like this cat. I like this... this just, just I can't wait till he graduates from tutorial college. He has melee attacks now. Melee attacks? Ah, uh, that seems kind of like a cop-out to me. I 
just bonk with my thing? I guess people couldn't grasp the the vacuuming mechanics, so they added in a, a melee for them. I love this. Eh. It is a pretty solid smacking animation, though. You're being asked, how does this compare to Ninpin Manmaru? Uh, I like this. this I, I, I like the controls here more. Ouch. Hey, it worked. Ouch, dude! <laughs> you see, he does have Camp California vibe. Sweep up those time crystals. Was the original Blinks considered too hard? Yeah, I guess if you consider it was being aimed towards kids. It was maybe a little bit less approachable than uh, what was on N64. Also, it looks like the time crystals now all have the shape of the power-up that they represent, so... Oh, good. Alright. Now, do you have to collect multiples? Well, I'll find out. It even gives you a radar. Okay. Okay, I have two retries. In my trash. Oh, multiple people confirming that Blinks is actually very difficult when you get later on. Okay. That's actually good to know, because it's not something Whoa, we can figure out. Whoa, let me radar! Oh, yeah! He disappeared. There he is. Got him. You only get three instead of four. That's an improvement, I guess. You're dead. They killed me. <laughs> they just dropped a bomb on me! They sure did. Now you're alive. Congrats, Grover. Grover lives. Surprised they didn't add a combo-based combat system. I'm sure they wanted to. Time crystals from time monsters and activated time control. Got it. Now for the fun stuff, he says. All right, time controls. Remember, just suck and blow. Crap. Lock on is helpful. Yeah, you have to collect multiple ones, but still. Hmm. Well, it's still good they got rid of, uh, like the chat says, the roulette system. Seems to be downplayed here. Okay. I think this was around the time as Jack 2, so maybe they took some influence. Oh, I see. Ah, okay. Yeah, pause it. Looks like they've redone the time controls, too. I guess you don't have to hold down a button anymore. Yeah, this is actually a lot easier. Do it. You did it. Wow. You're almost graduated. God. I'm so proud of you. That is a bummer. Oh, better fix the switch. Boy, lock-on's nice. It is. Oh, I got. All right, let's rewind. Lock on is super helpful. I really hope this isn't grim dark. <laughs> that would that would actually be pretty unfortunate. Oh yeah, suck up the bomb and take it elsewhere. There you go. Right. Oh, I love that I'm stomping on it's it. It's still got so, the stomping God, animation. God, I love his stomp. Okay, lesson seven, the final lesson. Use slow, use pause, and then the game can finally begin. All right. One more thing before we turn you loose. It's a bit try hard. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. Vibe, I think he should be cuter. Essentially, if you're in a jam reactive, can help you make that more peace. Oh my god. Okay, this. Links 2 is good so far. We just can't wait to get past. <laughs> oh my god! Sorry, it's like a QTE. 
We gotta get past this tutorial, though. Come on, yeah. just one more test. I know. Okay. Okay, I got it, I got it. Oh, it does have QTs, huh? I got this. I can press the right direction this time. Okay, I got this. I got it. It's, it's normal. It's normal. It's normal. I'm good. Why? Then left. Or down. It was left. I... You can't get that. Come on. Come on. Let's try again. Okay, here we go. So you have to make, you have to like, oh, I hate the reaction time you have to do with that. Uh-huh. Now, pause. Get out of there. Good. Way to go, you flat-headed little cat. He's so flat! Alright, you graduated. Now please start the video game. Come on! Let's go. Is that a Matrix gimmick? Is that all they were doing? Mm -hmm. They just made you Matrix dodge. They did. Because it was commercial. Blinks. Blinks, always looking after commercial interests. Here we go. See, it's I fine. got you past the tutorial. Thank you. Time is a treasure. Did I put in Dead or Alive by mistake? <laughs> it's so few. Understand its true value. I love that hardware store. Oh, this would have been after the matrices. So it wasn't prime time to put in a matrix parody, unlike uh, Conquer, which basically needed a matrix parody. It would have died if it didn't have one. Look at these kitties! CEO, time energy is vanishing across the universe. What? Check the mother computer. Do you think they have real-time fur rendering? Oh wait, this is, uh, this is pre-rendered. I also like that this is an actual job. It's his profession. <laughs> they have a factory. How do they make time? The big crystal. Oh no! They fucked up our workplace. God damn it. We were making time over here. Well. Yeah, it's just called the Big Crystal. <laughs> oh no! Hurry! Move it! Thank you, Blanks. I appreciate the help. Do you get to be Blinks' buddy in this one? I hope so. Is this like Sonic Forces? Ooh, I'd be okay with that. Oh man, look at all those pigs. Uh, thank you Spartanberry for the seven month resub. Spartanberry says, wow, seven months. How time just blinks away. <laughs> That's appropriate, thank you. I'll allow it this one time. I knew it. Pigs are a lot greener this time around. Yeah, I'm like, are they irritated or something? Is it like a platform? Possible nod to angry birds. <gasps> oh my god! There's blood! Oh no, they're not irradiated, they're just goop. We can't stop them. Enemy is at the computer core. Mother computer offline. But am 
my god, they killed our factory. The mother computer is dead? <laughs> what do we do now? Those pigs have no respect for anything. Yeah, I guess time's over now. There's no more All time. Right. Nice. Those letters from the Anyone who complains about daylight savings Something time, well, complain no more. Biscuit. Time is just gone. Gate room, this is the CEO. I have a top priority order. Open the gate to the ruins of time. Coordinates zero. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Why is that so funny to me? Latitude, zero. Longitude, zero. <laughs> it's called a big crystal. We can't leave in the middle of a fight. Listen to the CEO blinks. We can't win this fight, but we can stall for time. Go on. Only you can fight the battle at the ruins of time. I like how all these kitties have different markings. I do too. Just like real kitties. I love these kitties. I'm sorry. I probably have that brain parasite that love makes you love cats, but god damn it, I love cats. Yeah. It's a game for people with toxoplasmosis. It is. It's great. I just want to collect all the blinkses. I do. I love them. Bring back blinks. That is my one... If, if Blinks is not on the Xbox X, I'm rioting. I'm sorry. One man riot. It's, I'll be arrested within a minute and I'll be like, is this fair? <laughs> yeah, they have a Microsoft store uh, in town. We can go there. Okay. Actually, I think it's actively illegal to protest at that area where that is. It's actually in the rules, like no political messages. So. What if we're wearing fursuits, though? <laughs> you think they'll allow fursuits at the domain? I think if we had versions in the domain, like, there would be shoot on sight. Picaro here. Safely it's probably like a force field world. preventing from that from happening. Yeah. Yeah. Here. We've arrived in the ever snow world. Oh no. It's an ice box here. This is Pelon calling in from the Dark Valley world. Under attack by time monsters. Kron here at Woodstone. Kron! Calm down, guys. That place seemed fine. All teams, this is the Time Factory CEO. Someone has touched the big crystal and scattered it into fragments. They've set the universe on a path to utter destruction. Attention, all Time Sweeper teams. Boy, the they've really upped the stakes for this one. Won't mm -hmm. last long. Your orders are to spread out and search for the big crystal. Do I get a play? It's been like, it's, it's almost it's, like 920. It's, it's been a while. Let's see how the actual game is. Oh, here I am! There's your buddy. Oh, I'm so stubby! There's Stumpy. <laughs> Grover. Yes, Grover! The hot cat boy. <laughs> Who got hit by a 16 ton and squished down. That's his backstory. It is! He got a 16 Roger, ton weight drop I'm on him. Here we go again. And now he's a Chibis. A, a Chibis, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, break the barricade. Oh, you got options board. here. You can either destroy the barricade or steal the key to it. Ooh, All I right. like that. Let's so give you some options here. Checkpoints. This is pretty. Look at this. Oh, look at that. You're on look nice at island. my stubby body. Wow. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm glad your stubbiness doesn't affect your uh, freedom of movement. He seems to be pretty agile. You can still double jump. I'm afraid to go this way. I probably shouldn't. It I looks like you're faster than the first game, which is kind of nice. I am. I'm pretty fast. Ooh, trash. You also pick up trash faster. Oh, this is Wave Ocean from Sonic 06. <laughs> I hope it plays better. Respawn or find a key to open. Okay. Well, I'd love to steal a key. Can I not pick up the coins? Oh. oh my god, I'm so short! It's not registering me picking up some of these coins, I think. <laughs> You're too oh. short for the collectibles. I could have figured that out. Oh, you gotta expose them to air, which... Um, I'll figure something out. Yeah, you'll, you'll do it. You're a resourceful cat. Hey, lock-on makes this game so much better. I'd imagine, yeah. Yeah, this game is... I wish, I wish I'd known to uh, test that out to see if it worked in the first game. Oh, that's cool. So each time you collect the thing, it goes the the amount it goes under the whatchamacallit. So if you collect the 
wrong piece, it still registers as like if you collected one of these. Oh, it doesn't give you duds anymore? Yeah, nah, nah, nah. It all counts to like collecting three and getting the whatchamacallit. All right. I like it. Definite improvement. Sucking's faster. It is. Aw, he still does this you thing. still do the climb. Ow. Okay, this connects over here. Which... 16 uh, tons, what do you get? Another foot shorter and deeper in depth. Can I open up this piece? Can I lock on to it? Well, this is too complicated. Can you I'm suck up all the water? Am I suck up the water? Oh, uh, you gotta use pause? No? Okay. Alright. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, I see. Alright, what was the button for this? Left trigger? No. Trigger? No, it was... You went to college for this, Alex. Ah, oh, there you go. I paid for four years of tutorial college. He's so happy! Look at him! He looks shocked. Well, he is shocked because his... his Frequent checkpoints. Pretty nice. Considering the first game, you had to start the whole level over if you died. I'm still alive! Variable oh, I have life, a life meter! I have a yeah, life meter! Yeah, yeah, you have a variable life meter. It's not just three hits and you die. Yeah, see how the pieces just kind of... Okay, some of the pieces I can't get yet because I don't have that power, but that's... Still, it like, feels like they're evolving the mechanics, mm -hmm. like they actually put thought into it. Alright, they're like, alright, smack the wall here. It's Star well. Fox ass cutting <laughs> portraits. God they should be it. talking. I accidentally pressed the wrong button and uh did my pause thing again. Come on. Come on. Oh that's how it worked. You pause time and you displace the water because uh yeah. Ah, all right. okay. The science is sound. No! Can I can I yeah, yeah. I want to do that again, because I'm pretty sure I know how to not do that. Watch this! I'm just gonna sweep this coin. There we go. There, that's the safe way. Mm -hmm. I like this. I like this more than the original. I gotta say, it's pretty unique for a game of this time to have a fully customizable, playable character. Much less a squad that you get to pick from. I like the squad. That's detail that other people weren't focusing on at the time. Touch me and aim for the gun. Like in Ratchet and Clank, you didn't get to make your own Lombax. You were stuck with the default. Just gonna dash through the flames and the fire and the explosions and the... Those are crates. You don't suck them up. You explode them. Okay, right. Is that a milk carton? That's a milk carton! Oh yeah, if you play as the pigs, do you have a squad pig maker? <laughs> Can you make your own pigs? Oh my god. Oh, I'm fine. I'm alive. It's fine. Bummer, dude. I'm gonna say that every time. Hey. Yeah, I found the key. There you go. Now you can do it the non-violent way. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going for past this run, I guess. Okay, there's milk, but I can't pick it up. What What do I do with this milk? Suck it up. I, I've been trying to. Oh, maybe it's just, uh... Oh, wait, wait, a button press. Shrink? Okay. What happened? <laughs> Shrinking it right from the carton. Oh, I should Like a pressed. true animal. Oh, I think it gave me extra health. Yeah, it restored cool. your health. Wow. I am so fucking cute, I just want to say. I deserve that 8G. This game's really winning people over. <laughs> Seeing claims this is the best game ever, and you know what? I can't refute that. Some pretty good ideas. Nice moves, Grover. How do I use key? Cat metal. How do I use... Oh, here's where I use key. I'm so squat! I love him! Okay, I'll try that cat metal. So, if I die... <laughs> oh, I see. This old thing. You know what to do. Yeah, I do. Go back in time. Just rewind time to suit your own stupid cat needs. Who cares about the rest of history? 
you get what you want. That's all that matters. Okay. You you know cats would do that though. Yeah. They'd make it so it was always dinner time. Oh my god. That sounds like hell. There's stealth levels. I don't know how I feel about that. Mm. That was a requirement for a time though. Hand it over, I wanna play. Okay. Good there work. You go. Thank you. That is very cool indeed. He is so excited! Look at him! Yeah. Look at his mouth, he's just... He's saying it multiple times. It's like, calm down, my man. Okay, I get to play the video game now. Oh, look at his eyes! They're glowing! It just kicks you to the next level, too. It doesn't make you go back to the menu. It feels like this game has better flow to it than the first game. And it also has more... it has stricter progression. Like, they have a better idea of what you're supposed to do. This cat's so good in motion. <laughs> there you go. Enjoy. Wow, they did not like that. Yeah, I probably killed him. Yeah, that's true, Arnold Rimmer, and a lot of a lot of uh, Japanese media portrays cats as a lot more friendly than American media, where our cats are. Well, that's not true. Lol cats, I think, help with that. <laughs> but Lol before that, you had Tom and Jerry, and, and that was not good for cat relations. Well, I mean, think about Garfield. His whole point is that he's a piece of shit. Yeah. Who like has no regard for those in his life. I guess and... famous American cats are assholes. Yeah, yeah. Think of it like I can't think of a really nice one. I guess maybe Felix, but even he was a little sassy. Felix was mischievous. Yeah, I highly recommend pause because that slow shit sucks. It it it's not that fun. Yeah. Goodbye. There it goes. So the moments where you have to stop time are very specifically told in the game. Not no. something you have to figure out on your own. Okay, Felix is the best because he's public domain. Agree. Um... Yeah, I do like Top Cat. See, but the thing is, Top Cat's still kind of, you know... He's, he's, I, I like his anti-cop stance, but he's, he's kind of a scumbag, like, you know. A little bit a, of a scumbag, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, What's like, the time button? Uh, it's X. Okay. Thank you. Oh, no problem. I guess, I mean, but the swan cats also have attitude. I mean, so many of these cats are just so attitude-esque. And, and look at my guy. Does this guy look like he has attitude? I don't think so. He doesn't look like he belongs here. He looks like he's just Looks like it's his first day on the job. <laughs> he looks like you're gonna see him outside your door at midnight, you know, kind of looking for food and stuff, and you're just gonna be like, I'm... I don't know what to do with you. You're so <laughs> tiny. Are you a kitten? And it's like, are you like one of those tiny cats with like the short, like, that they engineered to have like the short legs? Poor little squash head cat. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Is that you? And they're like, no. Chug it, chug, chug it, chug, chug. 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 I like the chugging mechanic. <laughs> yeah, me too. I mean, yeah, it's true. I mean, real cats do have attitude, but they don't have that much attitude. I mean, it depends on the cat. I don't it's really it's... overstated. Yeah, like, do you, would you say that Buttons has attitude? Uh, a little bit. Like, not... I, I disagree. I think he has literally no attitude, but you, you do, you do, uh, you have lived with him longer, so. Yeah, I would know. I think he has more of a, uh, like a, like, like, uh, he gets what he wants, he knows what he wants, but he won't fight that hard to get it. <laughs> That's a cat who knows what he wants and will cave at the first opportunity. <laughs> okay, but Bugs does cave, you know that. He's just like, fine. Oh, I keep hitting that button, it's the X button, see? See? which you think is the action button. Yeah, yeah, see, that is confusing, it's not just me. Yeah, uh, Buttons is cool but rude, and Tess is, well, no, Tess is, Tess is cool but rude, and I think Buttons is, Buttons does machines, I'd say. Yeah. He, he. Seems oh, fair. Although I'd say he kind of leads, because every time he does a really weird, uh, bizarre habit, Tess picks it up, so. Hmm. This is, this is a lot to think about. Is there a Shrek cat? Like a, well, you mean like Puss in Boots? 
Are we talking about like a, 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 a are we talking about a cat who resembles Shrek or a cat from the Shrek uh, God, universe, the Shrekiverse, as they call it in, in the fandom? Keep no squat, no baby. All right, got it. Nice. A lot of snipers in this game. <laughs> Not more than I expect from a Blinks game. It's so. You know, I, I've never even I never even paid attention to the radar. I'm looking at it now, and it seems like it'd be helpful. Oh yeah, a little bit. Hmm, there's a thingy down there. Oh yeah, Sagwa, Sagwa. That was actually probably positive cat representation. That that, that she was she was she seemed helpful. I'm trying to drop these bombs down here. It's not really working. I think I have to jump down there. Time stop. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Blew him up. Good. Nice. This does turn you into time gal, which I approve. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've seen a couple of folks comparing this to time gal, but with a cat boy. That thing ate my bomb. What a dummy. Hel oh, helicopter? Mm-hmm. That was your objective this whole time, was to get the batteries for the helicopter and you got them. Oh, okay. Let's go to the helicopter. And then I think with the helicopter you're gonna, like, I don't know, probably kill things. I realize this is still one level. These levels are a lot longer than the first game. More involved with missions. That they give you multiple ways to solve, a la Deus Ex. <laughs> Maybe this game is the true innovator. Honestly, you joke, but there's, there's there's some good stuff in this game. Some forward-thinking things. I like being warned that enemies are here. Mm -hmm. I like making myself a squat cat. Mm -hmm. squat cat. Something for everyone. Squat cat. Are we talking about European cats? Those cats are horny. <laughs> what? Why? I'm sorry. It's like cartoon true. cats? Yeah. Did it. Nice. What is that? What moved? The door over there. It's uh, oh, there's I a see. pathway, yeah. Okay. There you go. Oh, I'm out of trash. That's my nightmare. Gotta it's, it's, always be stuck on track. Fritz is not good rep. Fritz the cat is not good representation. He's a terrible role model. He's a shiftless, useless college student. Ouch! Ouch! Who treats his girlfriend like shit? Let's try that again. How about you don't get blown up this time? Yeah, that's true. Fritz, Fritz the Cat is, is, is a movie about a bunch of assholes, basically. Yeah, essentially. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Chat's talking about uh, the Christopher Walken Puss in Boots film. Okay, Cats Don't Dance is good cat representation, although those cats do fuck a lot of things up, so... Hmm... I think Tootsies is good representation. Because, like you said, he he uh, he couldn't drive, but he at least tried. And yeah. you know, I think I think the onus, I think the onus here of, of the responsibility is on uh, Toons' owners who who allow Toons to continue to drive and kill people or whatever, even though clearly Toons can. not I'm asking this squishy little cat to do a lot. You really are. He's had a big day. Such a squishy boy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm turning into a. I'm turning into a, me, a so, like a, a meme mom or something. So, so the character creator is a hit. In other words, a thousand million percent greatest it, thing. It hit its mark for sure. Greatest thing I've done on Mascot Friday. There's a real abundance of enemies in this game, I've noticed, too. I guess because the objective's no longer to kill them all. You can just fill the levels with them. 
Not so sure how I feel about that. I am taking a lot more hits. <laughs> His All arms right. are... I opened up a shortcut to the beginning of the level. Hey, cool. Now I can get that helicopter. Do you know where the helicopter is? <laughs> no. Okay. It's gotta be your summon, right? Like... Maybe you can follow the radar? Oh yeah, good thinking. Let's do that. That big arrow on there. Hey, there it is. Okay. Oh, there was a good cat and grabby brush. Oh yeah, Dusty. Dusty's cool. All right, a talking cat is perfect representation. It is, I'm sorry, Duffy is the realest cat I've ever seen in my life. That cat is so good. That cat does not give a fuck. Well, that's level one. A really lengthy level one. I don't think that's to the game's detriment, though. It doesn't feel like it was too long. Wait, that was mission two? Well, whatever. <laughs> this is okay. It's a little bit less plotting, control-wise. You feel more mobile. Hard to say whether it's more fun than the first game. Ah! It definitely has more features. He is so excitable. If anything, this feels more fleshed out, whereas the first game felt like a, uh, just a, a basic startup of the concept. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Okay, y'all mentioning cats. None of you have mentioned the cat from outer space or that darn cat. Mostly, I'm assuming mostly because every time you watch the cat from outer space, the plot just, like, seeps out of your brain after. I've seen that movie three times, and I still can't tell you what it's about. <laughs> I assume the cat is from outer space and can talk with a magic Oh, no, cat. it's Knack! It is Knack! All right, I, I ship Knack and Grover. <laughs> That's right, I'm doing it. <laughs> It would be so... Cause, because Grover is so tiny! Look at him! It's so tiny and Mac is so big! Oh, how cute is that? Oh my god. Oh, these boyfriends are like... It's like... It's like Falco and Fox. I love it. It's, I, like, it's like we're from different worlds sometimes. <laughs> which I guess we kind of are. That's true. Mac can get smaller. He doesn't have to be large, but... My Grover is always tiny! I'm sorry. Poor Grover. He's just trying his best out here. Yeah, Grover can't touch his toes off. Dude, look at this. Yeah. There's two different worlds here. That's <laughs> awesome. Is. That's cool. This little settlement they got here. Is this the Alamo? It is. It is. Oh, you're in San Antonio. Where's the Riverwalk? Where's the Rainforest Cafe? Danny, if we ever go back to San Antonio, can we go to the Rainforest Cafe? Yeah, sure. What is that? Uh, it's a Landry's own theme rest. No, it's not. It's Landry's. Yeah, it's a theme restaurant um, with animatronics and extremely mediocre to bad food that's overpriced. Oh, okay. Sounds yeah. great. Yeah, you know what I love. Time stop. All right, where are we hitting this guy? Knocked him down. Shoot the core. Was there a cat in, uh... In... Yes, there was the, the cat girl It was in Food Fight. Uh, the, the Haley Duff? One of the Duffs played that cat girl from Food Fight. I guess that doesn't count because that's technically cat girl, but, I mean, Grover's a cat boy, so, you know. Was it Hillary Duff? I couldn't remember. It was Some nice duff. environmental destruction there. Like that. Okay, I hit him once. Looks like we need one more. It was a little hard to hit his weak point. I locked on the first time, but it just shot the bomb in the air <laughs> instead of actually hitting him. Fun time goodness. Oh yeah. Was her name Sunshine Goodness? Yes! That's right, it's all he coming back to me. He was a raisin mascot! <laughs> What a great movie. Oh, I haven't seen it in years. I need to watch it again. Maybe I should do that this weekend. 
Oh yeah, my birthday's next week, and we can watch that for my birthday. I once watched that movie sober. That was a mistake. Oh god, no! <laughs> oh Jesus. Anyway, that's the first boss of Blinks 2. It was okay. Pretty obvious what to do. Oh, you can see Food Fight for free now on Tubi? Okay, good, good. Watch that. That's my declaration to you for this weekend, everybody. Don't be sober while you watch it. <laughs> Yeah, if, if you're into sobriety, don't watch it. Or or watch it while, like... <laughs> yes! He broke my the, boy! He broke the cutscene because his face was too short. <laughs> my precious boy! Look at him! Oh, he met up with the squad again. Nice work. Oh, they love me! You take the fragment back to the time factory. You go on and keep searching. Thanks, guys. I don't think I could haul that thing around in my sweeper. No problem. We'll take care of it. Good luck. No, oh, he's got such a deep always, voice. I love him. They're always so synchronized. My boy. My boy. Well, if you love customizable cats, is this game for you or what? Grover. Grover. It's all about Grover. Grover, Grover and his squad. Grover, Grover. Grover Copter. Sheesh. This game, this game is, is making a big impression on Alex. This may be our new number one game. I don't know about that, but it's number one in my personal heart. Okay, so these areas are kind of like hubs. You return to them, and there's new stuff introduced. That cat died because I was too damn cute. <laughs> yeah, did it. So I can see what they're doing with this game. They fleshed out things from the first, uh, made it easier to control. This really feels like an improvement to me. Except for the idea of the stealth levels. We do have to weigh that into consideration. Yeah, I wouldn't want this game in stealth. But it does have a radar, so keep that in mind. That's true. I dare say, this is better than the original Blinks. If anyone who's played more of this and can say otherwise, please do. Mina, what are you going to do now? They cut the string of time. We're afraid your wish cannot be granted. <laughs> yep, ten more minutes of cutscenes. <laughs> That's another thing they've improved. Well, improved. So where are we going to see that leather dad? I don't think we're going to. Is he even in the game? Or was that just That's like the guy right there! No, no, that was the guy! I, no, 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 I mean the guy from the American cover. I mean, I think that was the I'm pretty sure it's the same dude. But he doesn't dress like that! Well, maybe he does eventually. I want to see that! Folks, do you know, do you know where that guy's in the game? Because if, if, I'm, if I am lied to by this cover... They may have just put the Leather Daddy Pig on the cover to, to sucker you into buying it. Damn! Oh, I see. This is the big moment. Oh, he's part of the group in the opening? Okay, so he did exist. Okay. Help! Is anybody there? Oh. My name is Mina. Linux Pig, Can help me! Hey, yes, hooks. <laughs> so you can hear me. Okay, this guy's good. Hurry. You need to find all the big crystal fragments before they. Boss, big news! Please, boss, wake up! <laughs> Well, he's shirtless, fulfilling the uh, the desires right, of, of many of you in the chat, I'm sure. Me, yeah, me. I like it. Keep that shirt off, buddy. It's Friday. We have to hand it to the Tom Tom Gang. This is a moment. You have to hand it to them. Let us all the Tom Tom Gang's success. I I love I love that they have their own. <laughs> they have their own propaganda channel. Their own competing news station. <laughs> That's a little too real. Mine! Mine, mine, mine. 
That dude seems twisted to me. So, who wants to join the Tom Tom gang? Do I? Oh yes, my! Yes, give me! Fucking god! Well, yes, 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 yes. You do. Yes, you can make a. Okay, okay. You do okay. indeed get no, to make no, your no, own. No, 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 no. Big squad. Wow, wow, wow! And you can give them big squishy heads, just like the cats. Oh my god, I'm picking that guy. Well, this is a, this is a dimension I did not expect okay, for this game. Okay. Uh, yes. Okay. First of all, that's just a really good design. It I is. really like that. Oh, I can give him camo. Oh my god, so I should go for... Yeah, oh, the, you could Yeah, there you go. Sorry, everybody. You did it. You got your leather daddy pig. I have to make a leather daddy pig. I am so sorry. It was not a lie. Oh my god. This is actually included oh, in the game. Oh, wow. <laughs> make him all denim. Uh, make him Guy Fieri. You picked Hulk Hogan. He does look a little Hogan-ish. <laughs> I'll fix him. Can you make an all denim pig? Do you, do you want an all denim like a, a Canadian leather daddy? A Canadian daddy? Okay. <laughs> Canadian daddy. I'm sure they... <laughs> Shout out to all Canadian daddies watching us. You are valid and seen. Alright, okay, I like I did, that. I did not expect the phrase denim daddy to be relevant and spoken in chat, and yet here we are. Alright. Mm -hmm. This mascot Friday is going right. off the rails. Well, this is interesting. You can experience the story from the other side. You get to see what the pigs, Here we go. What the pigs were thinking. Oh boy, we're in for it now. Bacon Bacon in the character creator. Okay, that looks good. Canadian Bacon Daddy. <laughs> okay, that looks good. That oh, a Dr. Robotnik stash. I don't know if I want that. Oh, I love that. Oh, oh wow. So much customization. His ears are way too long. Across, there you go. Across two different species, even. Big head. I, I appreciate, I appreciate He that. has a brain! Well, you broke the back of his head. I'm gonna break it some more. Uh, wide. I want a broad-shouldered. Tall, he's gonna be really big tall. Big-bodied. Massive, Everything. armed, tattooed. Oh, I can change his tattoos. I want to keep the tribal tat. And then another uh, tribal tat. A different tat on each arm. Big chest. Yeah. Yeah, max it. Max it all out. Give him those huge hips. Those thick thighs. <laughs> Happy Friday! <laughs> Give me some calves. <laughs> the biggest fucking mascot we've ever created on Mascot Friday. There it is. <laughs> What's his name? Well, it's not Rocket. I, I want to... Okay, chat. You get to pick his name, unfortunately. It's gotta be Daddy. <laughs> I was gonna say Daddy, but I thought that was a, a little... No, 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 no. I, I'm gonna go with Daddy. Okay, I'm sorry. God damn it, I can't type today. <laughs> Too. Name it Father. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Kevin Smith. Yeah, I saw people talking to him as Kevin Smith. Oh, wow. I love these emblems. <laughs> Alright, he's Kevin Smith in my heart. I like this one because it looks like a dystopian corporation. Denim Daddy works. That's ten characters. These are all good names. You can you can choose them when you play through Blinks 2, and I recommend you do. Oh, he's so stretched. <laughs> he looks like shit. He does. Those textures were not meant to be stretched in that way. All right, we're making uh, the... the United States of Pigmerica. All right. I'm saluting the flag. This is for all the. Um, I have another name. I'm sorry. All right, do it. I'm so sorry, everybody. You I think cannot... we've almost made the pig squad. Then we can see him in action. Please and make then... your post to denounce me. A S A P. Daddies. Hey, hey, hey. They all share squad. the same outfit. Do it. Confirm it. <laughs> yeah! Daddy, Fulviano. Uh, I didn't see the others. But they're ready to go. Good work, Alex. Oh man, this also has its own tutorial. <laughs> daddy and the daddy. We're consistent, if nothing else. Yeah, yeah. Alright, hand it over. Are you gonna try the tutorial? Yeah. 
What do these pigs do that the cats don't? Well, you can crawl under the laser traps. Oh, they're the stealth mechanic species. All right. Look at that ass. <laughs> oh, I stood up. I should have stayed down. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Okay. So if you're gonna have distinctly different gameplay, I suppose it makes sense to introduce a new species. Pigs are known for their stealthiness. Mm -hmm. That's why it's so dangerous when you get uh, those feral hogs, because you never see them coming. Mm -hmm. They have slingshots. I get you. You got ammo. You shoot it. How can that guy not... Look at this cool pose I'm doing. What are you even? Oh, he's grooving. Oh, man. He's moving to the music. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> this is this is beauty. We are Jesus. experiencing beauty right now. This game is a true modern marvel. Where'd he go? There's one. Oh, hey, I got spotted. It's weird he didn't see me dancing on the fence. He had other things to look at. How's he falling asleep? That was not the Palmer Lucky Time cover, Black. <laughs> You just punch and kick. You don't even have a weapon. It looks like he has shoulder issues. I get you, so the Blinkses control time and the pigs control space. They are masters of time and space. Oh! Like, oh! 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 Decoy. Wow, the Blinkses are... <laughs> oh, oh. Do they laugh at me? Mm -hmm. Stop it! I don't like that. Yes. Sorry, that's really funny. So you get different powers, and they're more focused on stealth rather than platforming. Okay, now get out of the way of that guy's laser. Good. I did it. I have learned the ways of the pig. So I take back my complaint about there not being um, leather daddy pigs. There are, and... There are indeed, and they are customizable. Even better. He just punches. He's got some real power behind those punches, too. Cool banana. Oh, it's his daddy every time. Oh, man. I made a mistake. Look at this punch combo. It's real power. I do like that you can use... Eh. Eh. There. Go? <laughs> go, 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 go! What's safe? That. That thing. Really? Or not, maybe I could be wrong. The safe could have been over that. <laughs> Alright, punching That's wasn't the, the solution. That's the safe. Okay, I see it. Well, I wanted to use the banana again anyways. I do like the banana. It's kind of hilarious. Very cartoonish. Classic stuff. Where'd he go? There's one. Oh, I'll do this. I believe in you, I'll freaking do this. I we have it. to do it before we rank the game. So how does this play as stealth? Like... It seems kind of clumsy, honestly. Not horrible, it's just, you know, a thing they put in the game because they had to. I have to. 
to. I know. I believe in you. I believe in you. Everybody, lend, lend. It's just a tutorial. I don't need your strength. Okay, I was gonna say I, I won't. I won't say lend uh, Daddy Danny your strength. Thank you. Okay. There he ah! goes. Good. Ah, screw that guy. There's a slot machine. Being a pig is hard. <laughs> you Got did it. it. <laughs> Let's go there. Get away with the loot. That cat isn't doing shit. Mm hmm. Oh, that's why they were coming up from portals before. Oh, clever. Space controlling pigs. Mm -hmm. All right. Part of the club. Shop too. Honestly, that was the one thing that was missing from our lives was your ability to shop. Listen up, all of you. The uh -huh. big crystal that Mina wants is the same one I almost had in my grasp. And this is where you bums come in. I like this guy. Oh, we got a goofy cartoon boss. I love him. I want to know who attacked the time factory. Who were those fake Tom Toms? <laughs> That wasn't us. Who goes right? And why they are there fake sleepers crawling all over the place while the time factory is under attack? Pipe down, you bums! Get back to work. Okay. Okay, boss. That's a Roger. I think. Yeah, the stealth mechanics are something I'm kind of mixed on. That doesn't seem like something that would work too well in the context of actual gameplay. I thought the core platformer mechanics were strong enough on their own. And need an extra species to control. Species with neck and back issues. Still, it's something. It's extra content. They tried to do more with it. Did they succeed? Uh, I need to play the game more to find out. I like this. For me, though, I like that they tried. Yeah, I don't know why they're calling me a little piglet. I am. Yeah. A big boy. I'm massive. Mm hmm. You know what? You know what this sounds like? Good judgment music. This is good judgment music. Folks, welcome to the mascot courtroom, where you get to decide what becomes of the mascots you've seen tonight. Based on what you've seen, please decide in advance whether Blinks and Blinks 2 are better or worse than Gex 64. You can vote with a Gex Cool or a Gex Nerd, depending on how you feel. A lot to think about, a lot to consider. Mm -hmm. So why don't you load up that list, Alex? All right, let me get that up here. Let's have load the list. I like the, the snaps. Me too. There we go. Okay. All right, last time we loaded this list up, we ranked a game called Whiplash. That was a good game. I like Whiplash. Whiplash was good. All right, so highlight Gex 64, if you would. Absolutely. There, there it is. is. Folks, based on what you saw tonight, is Blinks, the Time Sweeper, better or worse than Gex 64? Vote now! Your votes will carry Blinks to heaven or to hell. Oh no, our website's down. <laughs> Retropals.club, no. We'll get that fixed. Alright, I'm seeing a lot of Gex cools. That's a lot of happy Gexes. Yeah, this seems pretty universal. Blinks really won over the crowd. For a failed mascot for the Xbox that nobody talks about nowadays, honestly, Blinks was alright. He made a good impression on me. He's a little bit slower, a little bit stodgier than the platformers we're used to, but then again, he's not supposed to be Sonic. He's a, he's a thinking man's hedgehog, also known as a cat. <laughs> 
Okay, I see uh, put it above Hello Kitty, and I also see it should be between Gex 3 and Jackie Chan, and I'm also seeing it's not better than Glover. So <laughs> Not better than Glover. So basically, how about between Ninja Jaja Maru and, oh, Gex 3? That sounds like a good range to me. Not better than Apocalypse. Okay, yeah, so we're not going above Apocalypse. Fair enough. Yeah, this is a good game, not an excellent one. If you play it enough and you like it, you may decide it's great. Maybe it's a great game. But it's somewhere in this range here. Okay, we have some Glover uh, uh, discourse going on. Um, it's better than Glover. It's not better than Glover. Yeah, Gex Cool means that we're putting uh, Blinks above Gex 64 and yeah. the Gecko. It is, it is a pro Gex. It is a pro, I shouldn't say Gex. It's a pro Blinks judgment. Better than Glover. Gotta love the glove. Better than Glover. Okay, so above Glover. I'm seeing. <laughs> Glover seems to be central to this conversation, so let's <laughs> go ahead and uh, make it that. Is it better than Glover? Yeah. I kind of liked it more than Glover. Is Some it, may disagree. Is it better than Bomberman Hero? Hmm. This is tough. This is real tough. Okay, we're, I'm seeing the sequel is above Glover, but not the first one. Okay, yeah, do keep in mind we will be ranking the sequels, so we have to leave some room for improvement, if yeah. that's how you feel about the game. I wouldn't put it much higher than Glover, not better than Bomberman. Uh, I'd play Bomberman Hero over this. Okay, okay, so not about Bomberman Hero. How but about between? How about between Bomberman Hero and Glover? Okay, I think between uh, Bomberman here and Glover is good. A good start for the series, but there is improvement. Okay. Okay, alright. Do it, put it in. Okay, I'm doing it before. Slip that Blinks in. Blinks, the time sweeper. Better than Gex 64, better than Glover, not quite as good as Gump Bomberman Hero. That's on the Xbox. Is that our first Xbox? first Xbox. Oh yeah, our first Xbox exclusive. Hey. It's a, it's a real landmark day for Mascot Friday. Microsoft in part two. Ah, okay. the time sweeper? The easy part's over with. Mm -hmm. Now, Blinks 2, Masters of Time and Space, featuring playable cats and pigs. Is that game better or worse than Gex 64? What do you think? I'm seeing better. It's not <laughs> worse. Absolutely not worse. Uh, no. The no. character creator was really strong, though. Mm -hmm. Did you see how many sliders it had? Yeah, it was really good. Like dozens of different options for apparel, for for head size, head squishiness. You can make those. You can call. You can make the character name Daddy. <laughs> you can have Daddy rule the daddies. Okay, I'm seeing, uh, let's see, the pig segments are Gex Nerd, but the cat segments are uh, Gex Cool. Yeah, that's what's going to make this, what ranking this a little bit difficult. Okay, so here's the, the real question, the hard question. Is Blinks 2 better than Blinks 1? Yes. I think so too. I think the controls are more refined. Uh, they picked up the pace a little bit. It mm -hmm. no longer feels like you have weights attached to your feet. The uh, time mechanics were simplified but more effective. It got rid of that stupid roulette system. God, that roulette system really sucked. That was not not a good design choice. Okay, I'm seeing folks saying around Warrior World and Apocalypse. Okay, so the agreement is, yes, it is better than Blinks. I agree with that. I think Blinks was good. Blinks 2 just adds a little bit more juice, as they say. <laughs> I, I am wearing my Lammy shirt, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh... I could see it being the kind of quality of Wario World. Mm -hmm. That would, it definitely lives up to a second string uh, Nintendo published release. Uh, it was okay. nice, nice in quality. A lot of cutscenes, but don't let, uh, don't, don't hold that against it. Okay, I'm seeing between Hello Kitty and Wario World. I like that. Okay, okay, so that's a good range, folks. How are we going to narrow this down? It's I'd, not as good as Jet Grind Radio. It's no Whiplash. No. I'd say Wario World is pretty close to where it is. I think Wario World just barely edges it out, though. It's a little bit more focused. Okay. I'm seeing above 
between Warrior World and Whiplash and Better Than Apocalypse. Okay, you know what? I'm okay with it being Better Than Apocalypse. So I think so too. So above now, the question is above or below Warrior World. What do we think of Wario tonight? <laughs> how, does, how does he stack up against the Time Cat? Lab says the leather daddy pig goes below the whip. <laughs> That's just how nature works. And, <laughs> and with that, we have completed right, tonight's so, um, extremely above cursed. Wario world, uh, Wario. Ha okay. Um, things things below, said on a cursed mascot for Below Friday's Wario turn. world. Uh, I'm seeing a couple people just saying below. Okay. Um, Do it. Put it there. Between Apocalypse and Wario World. Yeah. Okay. I can't argue with logic. This gives Blinks me... too. Masters of Time and Space. Better than Gex 64, and better than Bruce Willis's Apocalypse, despite having no guns in it. Take that, Bruce Willis. Yeah, that's right. No, no guns uh, for us. So this is a pretty good game. Yeah, this is a... Uh, we rarely rank games that are in the upper echelon of the 3D list. So many of them are just generic and forgettable. But Blinks? You can't say that about Blinks. Blinks had a personality, not an overbearing one. It had a sequel that introduced some maybe less successful new things, while also overhauling the core gameplay. Mm -hmm. I think Blinks 2 is a stronger game overall. I think so too. And Blinks 1 ain't no slouch either. So if you're looking for a fun platformer to play on your original Microsoft Xbox with limited backward compatibility on the 360, check out Blinks. He's a time sweeper. He can stop time for you. Can you imagine how useful that is? There is there is discourse about whether or not Wario is a leather daddy. Can we move on? Oh my god. Well, with that discussion started, we can continue <laughs> it because it's now the weekend. Oh, hell yeah! It's Welcome the to weekend. the weekend, everyone. You can discuss all the things related to Wario, to pig leather daddies, mm -hmm. everything that belongs off the stream and not on it. <laughs> so please enjoy that and enjoy your, your free weekend. Play some mascot platformers. Yeah! Look up Blinks. Maybe watch the cutscenes. I might do that, actually. I'm curious to see how the story goes. Really impressed with Blinks. You know, these mascots, they just kind of go through you one after the other. They just, do. But Blinks, he stands out. You can't say that about everyone, and I'm glad we did this. Thank you for watching. Thank Alex you. is dying at something. Yeah, I am dying at this conversation about WarioWare being... Okay, no, okay, no. Okay, we, we, we clearly you, you, need you to move past. You can read it yourselves, chat. Uh, patrons, and those who wish to become patrons, head to patreon.com slash retropals. Our newest poll this week is up. Uh, this week we played Xbox games, you know, the real... It's it's the real AAA mainstream stuff. We need to go back underground. We need to get more obscure, more unwatchable. Mm -hmm. So I figure it's time to look at fan translations, because we haven't done that in a long time. Specifically, we're looking at fan translations released in 2019. So your choices this week are... Idle Hakenden for the Famicom. Linkle Liver Story for the Sega Saturn. Napple Tale for the Sega Dreamcast or Miracle Girls for the Super Famicom. Whichever one wins, we'll play a bit of that, plus a whole bunch of other fan translations for the winning system. It'll be a fun time. I'm and excited. And not just because it's a bunch of games about anime girls. <laughs> we all know how much you like. We all like anime girls. They're games. popular. We gotta cave to what's popular. <laughs> we do, we so, do. So I'm looking forward to that, no matter what wins. Uh, make sure you vote. I have a feeling this is gonna be a close one. Folks, it's either anime babes or Fortnite, so... Yeah, <laughs> Choose one or the other. Mm -hmm. All right, Alex, why don't you wrap us up? Okay, uh, we've also got a... Uh, our store is back open. We are selling winter merch with a uh, cute... Well, not, it's not as cute as uh, Grover, but a pretty cool design. So go check that out if you're looking to get a hoodie or something like that. And you're like, I want a hoodie, but it has to say Retro Pals on it. Everyone's got to know. Everyone's got to know that I love the pig leather daddies. So, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so do that. Um, we're also on YouTube, youtube.com slash retropals. We post highlights of our streams there. Next week, we will start posting the highlight of Lunacy. I know y'all are excited about uh, oh, Lunacy. Oh, yeah. I'm excited to get that up on YouTube. I think that's mm -hmm. one of our best playthroughs to date. And it's just a really weird game that represents us, I'd say. Yeah. So got to get that up. I'm excited. I really love Lunacy. As I'm re-editing it, I'm remembering why this is one of my favorite games. It's so good. Lunacy is so good. So look forward to that. Yes. Have a great weekend. Mm -hmm. And we'll leave y'all with Lord BBH, who is playing 
16-bit arcade ports. Right now he's doing the Genesis version of eSWAT, which is a significantly different game from the arcade version. Yeah, a lot of these games, when they ported them to 16-bit systems, they would just make, like, a different game. So that's pretty neat to see. And he knows a lot about eSWAT, so there's a lot of good uh, discussion to be had, I'm sure. So enjoy that, enjoy your weekend, and thank you for watching. We'll see you later. See ya, folks.